All right. So what I'll be doing is, first of all, I want to give a shout out to uh, Thriller Media. Y'all see his name at the top or their name at the top. Thriller Media. I'll be using Thriller Videos because he has the best sequences out. Um, They were one of the earlier ones, you know, on the case and, you know, trying to help us figure the shit out, basically. So, without further ado, what I want to do here is establish a certain point. And what I want to establish is the fact that, first of all, I want to establish the area of interest. That's what I want to establish. Right? I don't want to establish anything else. Whatever we see is whatever we see. But I want to establish the area of interest. Right? That's my whole point. Because I feel establishing that will get us further in the case. Now, I've already did this, but to a certain extent. It was a preview. So I want to give you the full rundown. I want I want to show you where everybody is as far as the ones in that room. 926 possibly 924 and also whoever is affiliated with them including staff including staff all right so i'm gonna try to run through this quick we got a lot to cover we will be starting from 320 this is roughly five minutes before kanika uh, comes off the elevator by footage. I don't care what we think, what time she got off, we're going by footage. And so this is the time frame that I'm starting from, 3.20. Also, I want you to understand that the time will be consistently at the top. Any questions, uh, if I was you, I'd put it on a maybe um, a computer, a laptop, Cause some of these these times you just will not see on your phone. You just won't you, you just won't see it unless you got a magnifying glass close to you like I do. But other than that, if you put it on a TV screen or you put it on it, like if you have the, those smart TVs that goes to YouTube, you can you can do that, or you can um put it on a laptop. So anyway, um. Let's start. Again, we are not paying attention to this kind of stuff. I mean, y'all can if you want to. That's that's totally up to y'all. But that's not my point. Now I want y'all to take notice that he's operating those walkie-talkies, right? So far, we see that he's operating the walkie-talkies. I don't know if he's checking them to make sure they're all on the same frequencies, but he is operating those walkie-talkies at this moment. Again, if you see anybody 
from the from the, the that hotel room or those hotel or uh, hotel rooms or if you see anybody um is affiliated with them especially the security guard Now the area of interest to me is this right here, all right? This is the area of interest to me. Either this or see over here to your left, we already know there's a row of windows that you can look into the pool area. It goes all the way around. When you see the, um. When you see the food court west, food court hall west footage, that area also, all the way around. We just want to establish a certain area of interest. I was also um, reading down in Thriller Media's, uh, not comment section, but his own, his description box, you know, where you put your, put whatever, you know, timestamps, he got his little timestamps and stuff in the uh, description box, and I was checking the shit out, and I noticed he said something about somebody looking over that stairwell. <clears throat> This is why we need each other because that's another key point that I have not looked at. That's another key point that I have not looked at. Somebody looked over the stairwell. Guess, guess, guess when they did it? Right when Kanika was down there. <laughs> yeah, we gonna show you that. I believe this time frame goes to, oh, it's not showing the name of it now. All right, bottom left, here's Kanika. So, so, so far we haven't seen any affiliates. And notice the lobby area and all that was not as busy until Kanika got off of the elevator. Now it just seems like everybody just starting to bum, bum just see what I mean? Coming from everywhere. They just starting to just bum the, 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 the lobby. Now those two at the top was already in motion. But it's everybody else that just so happened to just be so busy now. Like that's Kanika still down at the bottom left. But yeah, just like um one of my people um told me that's from Chicago, like the hotels is not usually that busy in the mornings. And it wasn't until Kanika popped off that elevator. Everybody just started swarming the fucking hotel. Running around and shit, trying to hurry up. Security busy. That nigga wasn't doing all that shit at 320. Y'all seen that shit yourself. Nigga wasn't doing all that shit around 320. 
When Kanika get this is just one minute after Kanika got off the elevator and they busy as hell. All of a sudden. People sitting all in the lobby and shit. Now I want y'all to see too. When Kanika go into the upper kitchen and she go around that, that damn um that corner where somebody pulling on her, cause somebody is pulling on her right now. When she go in that upper kitchen and go around that corner and, and somebody start pulling on her, and that footage ends, I want y'all to see how all of the activity ends. Watch this shit. The only one that's gonna be moving is this motherfucking manager. Y'all hear any noise in the background? That's me turning on my mobile. Cause I gotta watch my motherfucking cameras too. Okay, so here's Kanika <clears throat> down in the, at this bottom, right? And look how look how close this lady and this little boy is to her, and they don't even know she's right there. Like they are literally right around the corner. If she would have popped out, they wouldn't have seen her because she's still right around the corner from them, but. They were literally that close. They right now in that water. Don't even know it. His extra busy ass. I got so much paperwork. Now here comes the part. Where. Give me a second. When Kanika popped back out from around that, from, from around that corner. Okay, see this group right here in the lobby? That's the group to watch. Now they gon' they the one in the back with her hands in her pockets or whatever. Watch her. She's the one that's gonna see, I mean gonna hear something. And she's going to look over the stairwell. Matter of fact, she's going to alert her friends. You know how like, let's say y'all walking from the, um, you and your friends walking from the corner store, right? Corner store, gas station, whatever, right? And you hear something. And you like, did y'all hear that? Like you look right at your friends and be like, did y'all hear that? And they look at you and then you walk towards where the noise is. And they look over at you like, to the same direction you you going you know what i'm saying that's exactly what happened watch her the one to your left she's to your left now now y'all see what kanika at kanika just let me wind this bike just a tad bit about 10 seconds all right now y'all see what kanika's at right now pay attention to the fact that kanika is about to go under this camera and once she go under the camera, she's going to be going 
through those double doors. Now, I don't know if she went directly through those double doors after she went under the, under this camera because she could have been still at the, the, at the double doors without going in yet. You see what I'm saying? But just know that she just left from under this camera and I mean seconds. It's within seconds. They are right there. Like they almost to the stairwell up here. They're always almost to the stairwell. She's almost under this camera. Watch this. She goes under the camera. Now he's gonna put them on the south, south, uh, south. I mean, food court, hall west camera up here. Watch her reaction. She's way on this side. Watch her reaction. She stopped. Like, did y'all hear that? And went to the stairwell. Kanika's down there. You see what I'm saying? Matter of fact, watch this. We'll bring it up closer for y'all to see it. Watch this. So y'all won't say I'm reaching and all that old crazy shit. Y'all ain't finna do me like you do your boy. Watch, it's going to skip to 331. It's not going to take that long. Okay, here they go. Now, pay attention. Remember, Kanika just walked under the camera. That right? Listen, this is the stairwell right here. This is the stairwell. You understand? That's the stairwell. Kanika is right under that camera. She just went under that camera. Let me hit this. Sometimes this thing iced up. You can be moving it around and shit and they do that. So let me hit play and it straightens back out. But um, yeah, so Kanika just went under the camera. She, that's the stairwell. If you walk down the stairwell, you'll be right there where Kanika's at. You'll be looking at Kanika go through those double doors. If you go down those stairs, you see what I'm saying? This lady heard something while Kanika is still in that hall. Or she could have just went through those double doors. But these are seconds. These are, it's not like a couple of minutes Kanika done been down the stairs and she done went through the double doors and then a couple of minutes they pop up. No, I showed y'all just how close these people was to this girl. We talking seconds. Like two, three seconds apart. You see what I'm saying? That's quick. Watch. Watch her reaction. Like, y'all heard that? Boom. She looked down the stairs. Huh? Come on now. What the fuck is that? I thought she was supposed to be down there by herself. Did she fall? I thought she was supposed to be down there by herself. You see what I'm saying? And then this the thing. You're in a hotel. You're going to hear noises. So why did this noise alarm her? Why did why did this noise alarm her? She's like, did y'all hear that? And she looked down. See what I'm saying? We're going to watch it one more time and then we're going to move on. Before we do that, let me ref refresh your brains just a little bit. We're going to go back 10 seconds. Let me refresh your brain brains a little bit. 20 seconds. And look at Bree Bree. I told you, this, this, this hotel got live when Kanika got off the, uh, the elevator. This hotel got live. Real quick. All right, here's Kanika. Here's the group up top. Like I say, seconds. Watch. Just went under the camera. Seconds. And she's supposed to be down there by herself. Seconds. Did y'all hear that? Went to the stairwell. 
and looked. You see what I'm saying? What was that? And looked. And she supposed to be down there by herself. Crown uh, Plaza, you full of shit, bitch. Rosemont, PD, full of shit, bitch. Come on now. All this cricket shit. We gonna expose you. We gonna expose you. Let go. Tell the truth, man. Cause all this did this case, all this case did was put all eyes on y'all ass and put full lenses on y'all ass of everything. You see what I'm saying? Like, we wouldn't have known nothing about what happened with those chopped up bodies found on that plane. You see what I'm saying? In Detroit. Like, we wouldn't have known this shit. About the warehouse in Detroit. If it wasn't for the Kanika case. You see what I'm saying? That shit opened up doors for organ harvesting and all that shit. So we was wondering, like, what the fuck going on? See, if y'all would have just told the damn truth off top. Okay, this what happened. Blah, blah, blah. blah. Pay whoever you needed to pay. You know what I'm saying? After they didn't, they didn't say it, I'm finna sue your ass, whatever. Give me my money. You know what I'm saying? So I can bury my child. And you know what I'm saying, do other things and bring awareness or whatever, whatever. But no, y'all want to continue lying, continue lying. So we're going to continue digging, continue digging. Now, Kanika has went around that corner. Somebody's pulling on her. Footage cuts off. Hotel shuts down. Nobody is wandering around except for that front desk manager. Check it out. It's right down your face. Check it out. I thought my slow ass turned my camera on. Where the movement at, y'all? Y'all see the all the timers on each video or on each camera? The timers are still moving on each camera. Shit popping in. There's no activity. Once Kanika went around that corner and somebody snatched around that corner and that footage went off, there's no activity. Cameras and shit keep popping up, especially right here at the dishwasher. Why is that camera popping up if nobody is there? You see what I'm saying? That dishwasher is in that exact kitchen that Kanika just went in. That's lower level. I mean, come on. What the hell? What the fuck? Nobody's there, but... Camera still popping on and off, right? All right, this will start at 352. Now, this is when the so-called search starts with the, the, the people in the room. Kids, game bangers, whatever you want to call them. The Chicago hoodlums, whatever you want to call them. This is around the time when everybody starts coming out of those rooms with the fake search and the leaving. All right.
Now, this is when I need you to really pay attention to that pool area. Really pay attention to that pool area. Because I want y'all to see if, whether or not, people were already looking in that area. Were they already looking in that area for Kanika? That's what I want y'all to see. Were they? Because if not, there's a problem. All right? Y'all give me a second. Y'all see all the activity going on? So nobody has taken the liberty to uh, look into the pool area yet, huh? to my thriller man got that shit to the teeth <clears throat> and this shit take work because I tried to myself that shit take work I'm telling you matter of fact I was gonna do it this way but then I was like damn well, shit that's, that's gonna take some time so let me go ahead and just do it you know what I'm saying maybe two screens at a time or whatever man that shit took me to damn up five hours I swear to god I got the, I got the five hour video right now Oh, shit, I'm not finna upload that shit Because y'all ain't gonna watch it I ain't crazy I probably was crazy for doing it But I ain't crazy for up I ain't finna be crazy to upload it Like y'all gonna watch that shit Nobody is looking in this pool area They are not even concerned about that pool area They just sitting there chilling You see what I'm saying For right now Now this ain't the, Listen This ain't to debunk anybody all right, please don't get that energy started. This ain't to debunk any, anybody. Watch the whole video before you start making those. There they go. Shamaya, y'all seen her pop out. And what Shamaya say? After everybody was like, oh shit, they dead ass serious. Let's go search. And what did they do? They got to the leaving. That's how she put it. She said, did they search? No, they got the leaving. And that's exactly what they're doing, leaving. Now you can probably see the times over the footage a little better, the timestamps, because um, you know, 
there's less screens, right? So the screens are a little bigger. But I don't I don't know about your phones. But I know for a fight, laptops, computer, TV, you would definitely be able to see it a little better. But the times are in sync. I can guarantee you that. And every household should have a magnifying glass anyway. It's just, just needed. It's necessary. Look at this boy. Everywhere. All in the areas of interest. Like, who are you looking for? Do you know Kanika? Because you act like you're searching for who, who are you looking for? Do you know Kanika? Do you? Because we want to know. Are you one of the ones from the 11th floor trying to figure out where Kanika went? Or you just don't watch? Because this motherfucker was this motherfucker was affiliated with this front desk. I'm telling y'all. Like, like, like he was reporting back to the front desk or some shit. Look at him. So I guess he asking for directions, right? I think he telling her about, he telling that nigga about the disappearance of, of, of one of their friends. Yeah, nigga, you know. You know they already looking for him. How, how you know? How, how word spread that quick that they looking for somebody? On the front desk supposed to know about that so far. So how are you walking around? You ain't even affiliated with these people and you walking around and you just happen to hear this. Back in the area of interest, you can get to the pool from there. All right, this is 359 to 410. Now, I will be taking over after 410 as far as the footage because he didn't go. I don't know if this is he or she, I don't know, but this per thriller media did not go past 410 okay so i have to take it from there and we'll go from 410 to 440 we're just a little past 440 about five about five you know what i'm saying all right now what i want to show you is when i said that this motherfucker is going in the area of interest especially when he went into that goddamn little hall right there that when they bust that left up here in the food call they bust that left i'm gonna show you why i say that watch this shit This shit. Matter of fact, no, I need the um I need the actual map. Certain places I can't go in the hotel on that virtual tour site. Alright. Watch this shit. And for those of you who don't well, we'll get to that part. That's a VIP lounge right there where Monifa and the manager went. That's a VIP lounge up there, but I'll show y'all all of that. Anyway, because it looks over the pool. I'll show y'all all of that. But anyway. We're going to bike up. Now. This is where. That tranny. The, 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 the white tranny. In the white shirt. This is where that tranny went. Watch this shit. This is where they went. All right. There's two rooms here. There's a room there to the left and a room to the right. All right. These are also called ballrooms as well. 
But to me, they're more like practice rooms. If you had like a play to do or something, you want to practice or whatever, these rooms you can use for that or whatever. But I mean, you can use it for whatever they, they you know, uh, design them for, for, uh, for it to be done or not. But I want to show you why I call this another area of interest because it's close to the fucking pool. In fact, you can get in the pool from here. See, they're not going to let us in these doors <clears throat> on this site. So what I'm going to do. Hold on, let me see. Oh, they will. All right, cool. So this is shit we're going to do then. So check it out. We're going to look around, right? Oh, and they left the door open for me. Bless their heart. Feel me? Right now, this room right here doesn't have a back room a back door i mean that we know of see what that oh they'll let us peek around the coat in there thing like bless their heart all right so we're gonna go up out of here and we're gonna go to the next room this is why i call this area of interest to that pool let me in, bitch. All right. Now, hopefully they leave the door open again like they left the door open for the other room so you can see the difference. And they did. All right. So, y'all see that bike door right there? And y'all see the double doors here, right? Y'all know this leads back into the food court hall. Let's see if they'll let us out the bike door. The arrow's pointing kind of slim, so they might not. Uh-oh, they might do. Oh, let us out the back door. Oh, let us out the back door. Huh? Watch when I swerve it around. Watch when I swerve it around. That's the pool right there, y'all. That's the pool right there, y'all. Look, here go the back door we just came out of, y'all. Huh? Look. Holy shit, shit, shit. Look. Watch this. The infamous, the infamous microwave that everybody who reviews this hotel has a problem with. That one fucking microwave. Everybody who had a bad review for this hotel as far as being able to warm their food up in the middle of the night, this is the microwave that they're talking about. This is the only microwave that they were able to get to at night. Meaning if it was 1 o'clock in the morning, you want to warm up your food, you got to come down the elevator, come through uh, this hall right here, and boom. You at a microwave. The only microwave in the goddamn five, so-called five-star hotel. Feel me? And yes, this does lead back to the elevators. Oh, we gonna come back in this hallway because I want to show you that pool. Yeah, yeah, we don't play games. Y'all already know. So we're gonna zip on around the hallways. Come on. Come on. Y'all see the elevators? Hmm? Right? This is the lobby elevators. Y'all see that one L? Not two L's. Two L's is a lower level. This is the lobby elevators. And there's the lobby right there. And yes, there was a camera, but they said the shit didn't work. Conveniently, it didn't work. You feel me? So this is the lobby right here. If y'all ever read in this, any of the statements and they tell you something about a ramp that leads to the elevators, when they uh, first got into the hotel, this is that ramp over here to the left. 
And this is the ramp that, you know, this is a way up that ramp or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And then you have stairs or whatever. And you can go out the door right here and be in the front of the hotel, but at a certain time, that door is supposed to be locked. Now, like I said, we're going to get back to this pool. I want to see if they let me out the back. Because <clears throat> it is an exit sign right here, right? So I'm pretty sure there's an exit sign there telling me that I can get out this bank. Will they let us out though? If not, it's it, it's fine. We can go around back and I can show you the door, but not right now. Mm, somebody's already on the eleventh floor. Anyway. So let's get back in this hallway and let's get back to this pool. Y'all see it say stairs right there, right? I know y'all seen that. fire door you know what I'm saying there's all kind of little ways of just you know what I'm saying you can take the stairs and be right up in here in the cut don't nobody even know you didn't came down them stairs you know what I'm saying be right up in the cut look at that that sign says stairs stairs where stairs here the fire door there's another room right here, but anyway, so many ways up in this motherfucking, you feel me? Without being detected, there's no doors over here, it's just um, a wall of pictures. But anyway, so, y'all know how I show y'all that shit. Fitness room, you know what I'm saying, a weight room, to the left. You know what I mean? You got weights in there. Probably. Anyway. So yeah. This is the way to the pool. Yeah. That's why I keep saying. That tranny in that white shirt. Keeps walking in the area of interest. Because they can go in one of those rooms. And go out that back door. And be right there in the hallway. That leads to the pool. Alright. So let's get back to the footage. Let's get back to the footage. It is now four o'clock. Seen your homeboy jump on the um on the walkie talkies. Maybe he seen them coming and got a got a got alarmed and felt like he needed um security to um get down there real quick to help him out just in case he nigga wanna swing on his ass or something, I don't know, but see security. Flying back to the desk. Y'all see him? Yeah. 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 He jumped on that walk and told the man, hurry up and get down here, man. See what I'm saying? All right. Y'all pay attention now. They got the other one flying, flying. <laughs> y'all see him? The one in the red coat. You know what I'm saying? He alerted the motherfuckers quick. Hey man, y'all hear him get down here, man? Man, shit, these motherfuckers might fuck me up, man. I'm talking about they came too quick. Y'all seen that shit? Right around the corner, quick. Yeah. That shit crazy. 
once again they are not interested in this pool area see the windows right here you can you can look through those windows and look into the pool area we, we we've already established that right nobody is, is is thinking about doing so Now that dude right there, I'm gonna show y'all where that dude that came from. Or do y'all need to know? Let me see if I can pull that up for y'all. I'm gonna speed it up. Now, if y'all can't see the time at the top, just look at the bottom. He should be coming in in the parking lot. Yeah, once I see them headlights, I know that's him. All right, so this him pulling in. So this is around 339, so let me get it to 339 over here. Y'all gonna see him standing by the uh by the car for a few, and then uh he gonna head towards the southwest entry. So this is him, you can see him kind of fishing around by the car, then going ahead towards south uh, southwest entry. Let me pause this. Trying to give him the sink. Matter of fact, let me speed this up. He's gonna take a second. I'm gonna be walking behind that lady. That lady and her kid. Alright. And then it goes through. He get to the lobby. He make a right to the elevators. That's the reason why you see him coming back with his hoodie on. Because he was he was gone for a while you know what i'm saying he, he got to the lobby and made it right towards the elevators and he was gone for a while then he came down behind everybody else you see what i'm saying he got his hoodie on that so let, let let's move forward so i guess they're using him to you know walk them to the parking lot or whatever you know what i'm saying he probably like man if y'all man y'all come on you know what i'm saying Now, they are walking up in the area of interest, but will they be interested 
in that area. Now pay attention to up here too. Why they so shook? Boom. Monifa goes to that window, but she glance. See what I'm saying? She goes to that window, but she glance. Now, here's my thing about that. You go to the window and you glance. You may not see anything. Especially if, let me zoom this in just a little bit. First of all, it's dark in here. The only lights we see from the um, Food Court Hall West footage is the lights in here. Inside the little fitness room, right? There's, this this the fitness room and the other room I showed y'all earlier is the weight room. This is the fitness room. That's how, these are the only lights you see in the Food Court Hall West footage. You see what I'm saying? So if you take a glance in here, let's say, now I'm going to show you the window she's at. She's in this window. I know this for a fight. She's in this window. So if she just glance like I say this is a dark area the only lights is on is in the fitness room and I know that because I can see it through the window in the um the food court hall west footage so if, if she take a glance what if Kanika is laying up here like against the wall up here anywhere against this wall you're not going to see her I'm saying if I'm not saying she's in the pool area, but I'm saying if you're glancing and if she's in there and she's laying against this wall, you're not going to see her. Even if she's laying over here by this table against the wall or anywhere near this table, whatever, and you just glance in here, you're not going to see her. And that's what Monifa did. She glanced. That was her first time. The first time of anybody showing any interest to this pool area. And that was Monifa. And she glanced. Bree Bree didn't even look. Bree Bree just walked behind Monifa. Even though she did look, she, she didn't even get a good glance. She probably can't even tell you the color of the goddamn glass. You know what I'm saying? She she just walked behind her. It was so quick, it ain't even funny. Bring that back for about 10 seconds. And let you see it for yourself again. Now, hold on. Let me show you what I mean by you can see the lights on in the fitness room. See right there, them, them lights right there? That's the fitness room. You can see through this glass into the fitness room. You see what I'm saying? Because I can see the light glaring off of the, uh, the equipment inside the fitness room. I see the lights glaring off the equipment inside the fitness room. You feel me? Walking, walking, ain't looking, just walking, ain't looking, just walking. Ain't looking, ain't looking, just walking. And then, hold up. Monifa just decides to go over there. Now, watch how fast Monifa come out of there. And watch how even faster Bree Bree come out. Boom, boom. What the hell did Bree Bree do? You see what I'm saying? But at least Monifa looked over there. But that was the first time anybody looked over there in that area. Now the second time, I'm going to tell you heads up. The second time is going to be Shamaya. But it's going to be closer to the time they're getting ready to leave out somebody gonna be the second one to look over there in that area 
And then after that, oh boy. I'll show you some shit. And Monifa and them is not running. They are not running. They trying to get to that car. But they finna come back. You feel me? They finna come back. Old boy finna dip. Matter of fact, they gonna come back before he dip. I think he gonna be backing out. You, you'll see it. You'll see it. Okay, he's still sitting in the car and then they disappear. And that footage, that camera don't even act like that. That was done by hotel staff. They just disappeared. You see what I'm saying? The, the reason why the camera cut off in total is because, you know what I'm saying, Thriller, Thriller Media knows that they disappear in the middle of that footage. They just disappear. Let me show you myself. They just disappears in the middle of that footage. Well, we have 406. I don't know why that damn player ain't weird like that, but it is what it is. 406 what? Oh, 406 dirt on the dot. Look. Boom. Just disappeared. You see what I'm saying? Do that again. That's hotel staff doing that. That's not the camera. There's motion still there. In fact, the reason why these box, these boxes are still up like that, just solid on footage like that, is because this camera is not supposed to be jumping. There's no 10 second rules on this camera. Remember I told you if uh you're out of if you're out of um out of view or if you're a distance away, a certain distance away from the camera. After 10 seconds, the camera cuts off and then it picks back up in the next motion. This camera doesn't do that. That's the reason why those boxes are steady. You see what I'm saying? So why are they disappearing in the mid-air of the footage? That's hotel staff doing that. There's no reason why they should be doing that. Understand that. So that's foul play right there. Which indicates that they does this to other cameras. And we've seen other things that they've done to indicate that they do this to other cameras also. You know what I'm saying? This ain't just the only thing.
Monifa, I mean, uh, Bree Bree, she getting it, ain't she? And I hate that she left them like that because what uh, Shemaya and them going to do, they going to come up top. But because nobody is walking down here in this area, in this area, since nobody's walking down there in that, that area, the full court hall west footage can't be picked up. The camera don't pick them up because they're up top to the side. I mean, there's absolutely no foul for it. So that's the reason why they showed him here. But I mean, Monifa on the phone. Well, we could have at least seen them come in. So that's roughly around four or eight. Okay, there they go right there. Slow down, Gonzalez. So slow, slow down. Oh, that's yeah. All right. So they just walk on by this time. So the first and only person to show interest in looking in that in, in into the pool area was Monifa, and all she did was glance. Bree Bree just walked right behind her. 